Welcome to Company Showcase, an advertising feature on HowStreet.com. I'm Jim Goddard. I'm speaking with Larry Ray, CEO and President of American Manganese. Welcome back to the show, Larry. Jim, it's uh, the long weekend coming up, so I'd like to, uh, you know, say that I always enjoy our discussions. The markets were uh, pretty rough at the start of the week, and of course, you know, led by Facebook and, and its huge loss in value, and then Twitter, the same thing. Did that uh, kind of uh, sidewash hit everybody? Jim, the, uh, that certainly reflected on the entire market. It certainly reflected on the, uh, the venture exchange. A lot of stocks lost ground, including us, and it uh, looks like we're coming back up again. And if you look at the uh, chart for the last two years on Amy, you'll see that this is a, uh, a mirror image in the last year is a mirror image of the year before. And, uh, you know, the same timing, everything else, which, uh, you know, brings to mind maybe month ends for the brokerage firms. But regardless of that, uh, the markets have been weak, uh, but I've been saying that we can expect a better market. And I think we're going to see it starting this month, and we're going to have a good fall. And uh, certainly all of our news has been uh, not just encouraging, but very positive. And, uh, you know, so uh, you wonder why uh, a stock would go down when all the news is good, but that's uh, you get caught in the uh, stream, and that's what happens. And, you know, you just have to uh, work your way through it and just, the best thing that you got working for you is knowing that you have a very good product and uh, that uh, this is going to be temporary. With China's move to uh, make their entire fleet of vehicles electric in just a few years, what does that mean for a company like yours? Oh, that means a tremendous amount of uh, of uh, EV batteries there over the next few years will be reaching the end of life. <clears throat> it's good for the company. Uh, recycling the material uh, certainly alleviates the strain on mining cobalt and lithium, for that matter. And uh, so that's that's all good news for us. Uh, certainly, uh, China's uh, you know talking about recycling and they're looking for recycling uh, uh, solutions. Uh, and I've been saying on our on our discussions on uh, the, over the past. So a couple of months that we've been getting more attention out of Asia than we do out of anywhere else. We do get attention out of the U.S. and uh, and uh, Europe, but it's predominantly Asia. And now, uh, with the latest news uh, about recycling and uh, what they have to, what the uh, EB cards have to do about recycling, is uh, telling me that. Uh, some of the uh, battery manufacturers in Asia are definitely uh, looking for a solution, uh, looking for a recycling solution. So that's got to be very good for us. The uh, you know the tone was great for recycling a few months ago. Then it went into reuse, and now I see it's picking up on the recycling uh, front again. And that is uh, again good news for us because. You know, we've been saying for a long time there's a lot of batteries reaching the end of life that if we were in production today, we would have a steady, you know, feed. I don't know how many tons a day that feed would be, but we'd have a uh, definite uh, feedstock for recycling. And uh, that's only going to increase as uh, time goes by. So that's good news for us, Jim. And, uh, you know, we've uh, been... Working, uh, has been working away on our, uh, on the bench scale, on disassembly and, uh, recovery from the disassembly process. And we'll be talking more about that once we, uh, we press release some stuff. So it's, uh, you know, it's, it's all coming together and, uh, you know, we just see that this is a great, great opportunity for the company. So, and I think I do believe that, uh, that the Australians will be working on our project in the next few weeks uh, up at uh, Hazelton. That's the high-grade uh, gold and uh, gold, copper, and co- cobalt property that we have there. So there's going to be some, you know, hopefully, some news coming off of that. And uh, so it looks like they're coming through the uh, summer. It's uh, been a very hot one, and 
Now it's cooled down for the weekend, which I think is good. I just hope there's not a lot of fires that uh, screw up camping for people. But, uh, you know, it's uh, certainly definitely cooled down and makes it a, it's an easier environment to work in. So I don't, uh, you know, other than uh, this market reaction that we've had, which has got everybody's attention, and, of course, Apple uh, reaching a $1 trillion market cap is just fantastic. I mean, it's the first, the only company in the world that has that, and uh, that's, uh, you know, very close to what we do. Apple uses about three or $400 million worth of cathode material a year, uh, for their handheld and uh, tablets and all those types of uh, their iPhones, all those types of uh, applications that uh, can, can be recycled. So that's a yearly recycling uh, situation that's uh, worth three to four hundred million a year, and certainly would uh, uh, help Apple with their uh, with their uh, problems with people, you know, criticizing the fact that they've been perhaps using some of the uh, stuff out of the DRC that uh, involves child labor. And uh, whether that's true or not, I don't know. But uh, we're hoping that our uh, our process would be alleviate that for companies like Apple. And uh, I'm sure it will. And so I'm optimistic, Jim. I'm optimistic that we are moving in the right direction. I'm optimistic that... Uh, Things are coming together as they should. We're meeting expectations. And uh, I'd just like to take this opportunity to wish our shareholders a great long weekend. It's uh, a long weekend that uh, uh, I'm looking forward to. And uh, I'm certain a lot of people out there are looking forward to it. Larry, where are you traded and how can people find out more information about American manganese? We're traded on the Toronto... Uh, uh, venture exchange under the symbol AMY. We're traded in the U.S. under the symbol AMYZF. We're traded in Frankfurt under the symbol 2M. And you can reach us at AmericanManganeseInc.com or you can phone at uh, 778-574-4444. Or you can email me at l-r-e-a-u-g-h at a-m-y-m-n dot com. I've been speaking with Larry Ray, President and CEO of American Manganese. I'm Jim Goddard. Our conversation took place on August 3rd. Comments made on Company Showcase are an expression of opinion only and should not be construed in any manner whatsoever as recommendations to buy or sell any financial instrument at any time. Archived online at HowStreet.com. Company Showcase is a production of How Street Media Incorporated.